Hello, this is Miguel, research engineer of the Hardware and Mechanical Design Unit at the Robotics, Vision and Control Research Laboratory at the University of Seville. Today, we are going to introduce the TT drone, an aerial platform designed to inspect units. This use case involves an unmanned ground vehicle, an unmanned aerial vehicle. The TT drone platform aims to perform a comprehensive inspection of tunnel to detect defects in the infrastructure. It does by capture, capturing images and analyzing them using artificial intelligence algorithms. Power and data are transmitted from the UGV to the UAV using a tether system. The fact that the TT drone is connected to the UGV by cable is a great advantage. The dimensions of the platform are limited as it must be a small and compact UAV that can perform takeoff and landing maneuver on the car rooftop with the minimum of effort. This requirement immediately ruled out the extra rotor configuration as it would involve modifications to the platform frame. Therefore, an octal rotor coaxial configuration was chosen. The selected configuration provided the necessary thrust, improved the maneuverability and enhanced the stabilization of the UF flight. This enabled the platform to fly with the tether system, procession system and onboard computer. Focusing on the platform, you can see some very different parts, each of which fulfills a fundamental function. Central structure, the main structure, is composed of the base frame and the auxiliary frame. The base frame houses the gimbal that supports the inspection camera in charge of the photos, necessary for the inspection of the tunnel and the nook required to complete the perception module of the drone. In the auxiliary frame, we can find the Arduino box that controls the operation of the electromagnet, POE used to power and connect the ubiquity to the NOC, a USB hub that increases the number of connections with an onboard computer, and finally the emergency battery used to perform landings in the event of a loss of connection through the Tethered system. All this was complemented with a 2D leader and beacon sensors for robot localizations, autonomous navigation. Finally, four legs with electromagnets at the ends supports the UAV for easier attachment to the rooftop of the vehicle during the landing and transport. <laughs>